Hey guys, Master Games, back with a new Hero.com video. This one is a hero, or not hero, sorry, mission review. I will be playing as Spider-Man, as you can see, and I will be reviewing Clon Disorder today. Um, Clon Disorder is a pretty easy map, or map, sorry. Uh, I'm tired today. <laughs> a pretty easy uh, mission to do. Um, Doc Ock is a, kind of an easy boss. I wouldn't say he's really easy, but, or like, he's not the easiest, but he's not awesome. Like, he's not a hard boss. Alright, so you start out against these Octobots, and whatever those things are, I don't really know, because they're not Doombots, and they're not, um, <coughs> I don't know what they are, so let's just keep it at that. Um, so, you can blast through those really quickly, and then you can, uh, hit all these trouble bots, and they do some damage, so, um, uh, I'd watch out for them, kind of, and I'd get them first, because they are, those seven damage, uh, by probably three of those, that's 21 damage, and that's quite a lot, so, uh, get those knocked out, get them out of the way, so you can deal with these other guys. Uh, um, I'd really suggest Iron Man for this mission, um, or Spider-Man, he works pretty good too, um, any guy, really, except for a really close-up guy, I don't think the close-up would really do that well against Doc Ock, because of some of his moves he does, um, so, I suggest Iron Man, Jean Grey, those types of heroes. Um, and, oh, they're still alive. Um, and that's probably about it I have to say about this mission. I mean, it's a very fun mission. I suggest it to anybody, not just um, advanced players, but to everybody, because it's pretty easy. And, uh, so now I'll just finish out the mission so you can see and make sure you should buy this mission if you're planning on doing so. Um, so yeah, I'm done talking. Alright, All right, right here I guess I'm not done talking. I have to mention this one thing. Once you defeat these guys, you do not want to use your hero up for them. They're easy to beat. Um, what you want to use it for is this uh, pretty hard Octobot that comes out right here. He's the boss Octobot, and he is uh, pretty hard to beat. Uh, so you want to save your hero up for him. <coughs> Sorry, still kind of sick from my uh, sinus infection. Um, see, he has a lot of health, so you definitely want to save your hero up and do it for him. Um, Alright, so first stage is complete. On to our second stage. I think the second stage is very easy. It's probably easier than the first, in my opinion. Oh yeah, because they, in the second stage, they use a lot of more of these red guys. Um, but you still have two of those uh, uh, big octobots in the end to ha that you have to uh, kill. So that's one difficult part about uh, the second stage. And they do come out at the same time, so... Again, you want to save your hero up for what looks like uh, the last part of this stage. Um, again, as I suggested earlier, I would definitely try and kill those trouble bots first, because if you don't, they could actually kill you. Um, I know they're small and they're easy to kill, but sometimes those small things can really uh, hurt you in the end. Hmm. 
Also, I'd use the uh, trains that come down that target over there. You see the thing that came down. Um, I'd use those to your advantage. Try to make a, da a guy go under that, and it'll do, I think, 30 damage to them. I think. Um, so, yeah, use those for your advantage, but avoid them. Like, if you're under them, I would not be under them. Like, right there, I might, yep. I told you, I'm, I was under it. Um, it, but I think it did some damage to those guys. Um, even though it didn't show it. Oh, I guess, never mind, this is not the mission that has two of those. Uh, so don't worry about what I told you earlier. That's Akatini that has the double uh, bad guys. So the end is pretty easy. Um, Alright, so any health you want, you should probably get. Or need. See? Okay, so that does 25 damage to each time it hits the guy. Um, these trouble bots really are annoying. Um, yeah, he has like 180 health, so yeah, I'd really save your hero up for him. And there you go. He's gone. Alright. Stage 3, on to Doc Ock. Doc Ock is a pretty easy villain. Um probably depends on the hero you are if you're a very close up hero he might be more difficult but um for kind of a mid range like spider-man is kind of he's not hard um so let's get to this boss so there are three uh Really good attacks that Doc Ock does, and well, that one is one of them. It does 70 damage, and it's not really that nice. Uh, if it happens like two times in a row, it really is not that good. Um, that one also, it doesn't do damage much, but uh, it does annoy me a lot. That one also kind of sucks if you get hit by it, but... Uh, if you focus, you should not be able to be, uh, hit by it. Um. That one. That one's bad, too. That can really cause some damage to you. And then that one again. See, I'm about to die. That, that attack you just want to watch out for. And so do you, so you want to, you also want to watch out for that. Oh, I'm about to die. <coughs> there we go. Alright, let's do our hero up on this meanie. Okay. 15. Uh, yes, health. Thank goodness. So yeah, I mean, Doc Ock is not one of the best bosses. I uh, hope you know what I mean by that. He's not one of the hardest. But he certainly isn't one of the easiest. <coughs> Alright. Uh, so I will show you what you can get for this mission. If you get an Adamant Queen Metal. Um, you can get 225 XP, 12 Fractals, 1 Nudigan, or Nudigan Canister, and 2 Ingots. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, comment, I'll comment back to you, um, see you guys later, have a great day.